Hello everybody and welcome back to Final Fantasy 12 where once again I'm just gonna be listening to podcasts and stuff <laughs> while we do some more grinding so you guys won't get to see much of that but I've been catching up on my podcasts that I haven't been watching because I've been just fully immersed in the world of Chinese dramas the occasional K-drama I started like in February and I just, I'm only now starting to pull my life together a little bit back to the way it was <laughs> before. <laughs> like, but like mid, like early February to mid February, I was doing great. Like had, had things on track a bit, you know, um, was like being pretty productive and all that. And then I found the untamed and life just has never been the same and I don't regret it it was super, it's super awesome stuff and I've rewatched some of them like a couple times but anyway that's not why you guys are here uh, we are heading out down south or yonder um, but yeah since I've decided I just can't I can't fill the time for with all the grind with just inane talking like I just ooh, look at this I just, I don't think I'll be able to do it. <laughs> Even if I come up with like cool topics and stuff, you know? Um, oh, I should actually switch out. Um, but yeah, I don't think I'll be able to just like keep talking with nothing really to say. Like I could come up with cool topics, like a list of topics and all that stuff. Like I could do that, but um, I just don't, like, I don't think it's very feasible, like, super feasible for me all the time. So what I've decided to do right now is to just, um, do the grind on my own, listen to podcasts that I haven't listened to, that I need to catch up on, <laughs> and let you guys just know if something interesting happens, you know? So... If you want, I, I don't know, I, I could offer this, I guess, no harm done, but, um, I can, I can always take out my commentary and just leave, like, basically, like, a, like a no commentary video during the grind, because I know some people find that relaxing, so, um, no big deal either way, whether you're for it or against it, I have, I have no preference, so, but we're gonna try to get up to level 18? Everybody, maybe we'll see how that goes. <laughs> it might take so long, but the next area really is pretty rough. So, uh, was this, I feel like there was something else I was gonna say. I can't remember if there was. If I think of it, I'll let you all know. But until then, I'll see you in like an hour. <laughs> Ooh, oh my gosh, I just took a break to eat some hot wings. My mouth's on fire. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm not gonna be able to play the game. Oh, we're going back into the Ozmone plane, which maybe isn't a great idea, but we'll see. Uh, the squad I had earlier, uh, that had, um, what's his name? Vaughn. The Vaughn Ash Pinello squad was working pretty well. Uh, he leveled up to 18 pretty quick, so, and then, so then I brought Bashram. Um, but Ash should be, yeah, she's getting close to level up, and we'll switch her out for Fran or Balthier, but I don't trust Fran or Balthier, despite them probably being my favorite characters. <laughs> I just, I haven't specced them well or something, but let's see, uh, no, 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 you don't want to hate the cute bunnies. Let's see how we do against one of these horses. These giant armor horses. <laughs> okay. That's not bad. It wasn't these guys that were giving me like a ton of problems. Like I was able to kill these guys. It was like the big, tall Goliath things. I was like, get it! <laughs> it's run away! Pinello is level 22. It wasn't Ash, right? That leveled up. Oh, it was! They leveled up simultaneously. Okay, so we'll take Ash out and bring Fran. See, do we have any? Oh dang! Oh good. Let's see. So we're on her white mage. Oh, wait a minute, hat shirt. We have that. So 
Might as well. Um, it's the rod thing. And right now, I think I have, do I have her use? I think I have her using a rod. All these, all these what? These abilities. Okay. Oh yeah, I have a student which need to buy it. These ones, I just don't, like, I'm not... Don't have... Those spells, you know? And that seems too risky. I don't, I don't like it. Look, one for any harmful status effects on the user. So this magic potency, either accessories. So many accessories. Let's look at time magic. Oh, that's right. We can give her heavier armor. Hmm. I mean, it's not a bad idea. And, well. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, she's got the blowgun. Or the dart, the crossbow. Um, let's give her a gamut slot. I'm not sure what I'll do with it, but... The healer time mage with extra stuff is never a bad idea. Oh, that would be good too. That would, like, increase her, like, protect and stuff like that. Uh, what do you want? A war hammer? Frick. I think I still have her use- well, yeah. I have her using a bow right now, but it's not- we could switch her up. Like, I want to- I want to give her the options. Ooh, what are these? Genji armor. Exsanguinated, so she makes people bleed with that armor on. I think I already gave her... Yeah, I already gave her chain mail. I'm just gonna do basic stuff. Oh, wow. That's pretty dope. This would be nice, though. Is Shikari. Let's switch him over. Level up hit. Oh, sure. Light armor. Any more techniques? Sure. We get hit. Coach sounds like a good one for him. Max HP increase? Sure. Oh, I don't own that. I forgot I unlocked that for him, but I would need to buy it. I didn't do that. I should go see if I can find that somewhere. Anyway, I'll let the others kind of, like, level up. I don't know. Do we have anybody who can do anything against this? Just friend? I think just friend. <laughs> I mean, it could drop, but apparently not. Slow. Oh, I'm so full. I had like some curry, and then my friend was like, like, like 30 minutes later, she was like, You want some hot wings? And I was like, I never say no to hot wings. I should have, or I should have saved them, but they were very good. Yeah. It's basically just a uh, brand soloing this thing. Come on, Kazu! No! I think we killed it though, which is good. 
but she doesn't really need the XP because she's so high. She's so far above everybody else. Anyway. So far, so good, at least in this particular area. Don't, did I, did I even, I don't think I, I was trying to, like, explore this area further. I think is what happened before, and I totally, what? Yeah. What? Haha, -ha. oh, I was, actually. Why not? I forgot we have regen. I think that's new, actually. I don't think I had that earlier. I must have, I must have owned it, and then... Okay. And then, like, unlocked it recently somehow? Cool. So we've gotten pretty far, and we're doing all right. Um... I'm just kind of heading south for now and hoping for the best. I've been recording for about an hour, but I think uh, the episode will still be going because not much has happened. But we're almost all to level 18. Balthier has like five, 400, 500 points left before he levels up. But I'm feeling pretty confident. We're, we're not having too many troubles. We're not dying too much. So but yeah, we'll keep going. Uh -huh. Ah, turn my podcast off. Okay, here we go. We found it, question mark? Is this the one we're looking for? The town? It is. Oh, dang. Well, oh, maybe not. It is a town, however. Let's save. I we're looking for, like, the Gareth village? <laughs> Yeah. I hope I'm even going in the right place. Yeah, okay, here we go. Who are you, Garifland? No place for Hume children. Oh, hey! I've seen these people out in the wilderness as, um... Like, uh, passive mobs. They don't do anything. And I actually purposefully didn't attack them ever because, uh, I don't like attacking humanoids unless they're gonna be aggressive. So I didn't attack any of them. So that's cool. Yeah, yeah, we are warriors of great distinction. And I didn't kill any of you. Oh, this is the war chief. Oh, snap. <laughs> business do you have? Just nod my head. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, I have business with you. It's kind of interesting, you can't really tell. Oh, there's a lot of humans walking around. Can't tell the, the difference between the war chief and the soldiers. Or at least I can't. Off the top. I'm a, a, my head. I am Supinilu, war chief of the village. We have been friends to all since long ago. However, lately the human world is in much turmoil. We must protect our village and our people. As war chief and protector of the land, I ask you why you come to this land. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Blah, 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 blah. Ah, I also... So there's others coming to ask about Nethosite. Oh, okay. Though our mask may make it difficult for you to tell us apart, walk through the village and look with your eyes and listen with your ears. Ah, it's a test. Tis a test. I have. Where are they at? Are you guys, the, are the elders, chilling next to the water? No, nope, apparently not, but you're living your best life. I assume the elders would be in a central location, but we'll just chat with people. Learn of the stones, yes, yes, yes. Can't talk to you. 
Zertanian Caverns. I actually did pop in there for a second. But then I popped back out again. Aha! What is it, Hume Child? Have you something... They're a little... I think they're a little bigger. Something to ask about this wizened man? Uh, you wish to know of Nanthestite? It is a word I hear quite often of late, though I know not why, nor do I know anything of this stone. So too did I tell the Hume Child who asked me before. I am sorry. Ask another of the elders. Perhaps they will know. Are you an elder? You Hume... Yes. <laughs> I am Supinu's brother, Catalu. I worry for Supinu often goes to the plains alone. Why would others surely wish to train with him? He is stubborn. Your pardon. Please forget it. You have bits with the elders. Yes, off you go. Of course, the elders I'm looking for could not be the ones that are too close to the front entrance. That would be too easy. But they are apparently going to be spread out, so... Herder? Okay, thanks. Elder, haha, you are a little bigger. Give the look of someone who wishes to know something. I, it is something that I know good. Ah, the Nethesite, you're not the only one who asked me about this. It saddens me to admit I know nothing about the stone. The Magicite contains within it a great power, thus we have worshipped the stones from the beginning of time, yet I had never heard of this Nethesite. Perhaps the High Chief knows something. Wow, there's so many. There's like, there's the War Chief, the Elders, the High Chief. If you have not spoken with him yet, go. He will be with Geomancer Yugulo. Yugulo? Alright, here I go. Oh, a store. Store. Where do you go? Flame Tongue? Whoa! Oh my gosh, freaking katana. I just spent well. It's it's good. I was like, I just spent so much money on gear, but it's good I did because I that made it get made us get through that area a lot easier. A water maze. I don't have anybody that can use a maze. Long. Oh, dude, is this your better? It's such kind of a better gun. I should have gotten uh, what's his name. Both the ear, the crossbow thing, but that's okay. I like him with the gun. Nobody can use the gold, the gold weapon shield thing yet. Seven iron carapaces. Oh my gosh. Should I buy the sword? I can I only have one guy that uses swords now, but I should actually buy him the katana if I'm gonna do it, but it is two-handed, so you wouldn't be able to use his shield, which is less than ideal. I don't have many shield people left. I'll wait on that. Merely bearing one of these on your person aids in the retrieval of objects from the foes you defeat. Okay. Oh. I, d I don't have monographs, I don't think, but... Oh, you look important. Oh, I already talked to you. Warrior. Did I already make a circle? Nope. More humans, a little bigger this time. A little bigger? Is there somebody smaller than me running around? Burnett the site. We have knowledge of this. Apparently you don't, because some of you, lots of you don't seem to know what it is. Some of it remains, some has been lost to history sands. You know, you said you, he just said he, I swear he just said he did, or she, I don't know. He or she said. 
We must speak to the great chief. He alone holds the deep knowledge of these things. He alone remembers all the tellings. Uh, cross the bridge to the north, and there you'll find him. There are watchers at the bridge, so I think it's best to speak with Lord Chief of Supine Lou. May I ask you a favor? Give this to Lord Chief of Supine Lou from me. Sure, he's just right over there. A giant stick. Thank you. I just came from him. Where did he go? Ah, the draw distance. Yeah, yeah. You're welcome. <laughs> Even the high chief couldn't have. Yes, I want to meet with the great chief. Uh oh. Oh, hello. Ash, I must learn more about the Nithisite. I cannot turn back now. Please, tell your great chief that I am of the royal line of Damascus, a direct descendant of Dynast King Wraithwell. If the Gareth have passed down knowledge of the stones, they must know the Nithisite that the Dynast King once held. Do you have proof of your- Listen, we've had a lot of problems with that. I do not. Hmm. I have looked into your eyes and seen that you speak the truth, human child. I give you this trust. The great chief is ahead across the bridge. Thanks, guys. I appreciate it. Easy peasy. Was that... Are you the great... Oh, yeah. Oh, it's like he's literally just right there. Oh, here we go. Full cutscene time. His headgear is amazing. I think it's natural. I think it's grown. This Nethysite. You have used it. It was not I who used it. Indeed, I had hoped you could show me how. Thus I've come. Hmm. You do not know the workings of the stone. Then we are no different. What? Oh, jeez. Again. In ages past, the gods made a gift of Nethysite to my people. But the manner of its use eluded us. What a terrible gift! Displeased by our failure, the gods took back their stones. What was buddy? They chose instead to give them to a Yum king. Oh, oh, really? This narrative? Garbage. Called the Dynast King, he used the Nethysite's power to bring peace to a troubled time. Only it humans. It is a curious thing. Only humans can unlock the power. Though the blood power. of King Wraithwall flow through your veins, you cannot wield Nethysite. Cannot wield it? So then, am I to understand you can't tell me how to use the stone? Though it shame me so to admit, here before me stands a descendant of the dynast king himself, and I can accord her no help at all. Still, even if you knew how to use the Nethysite, you would find it of small avail. The mist collected in the stone over ages past is lost, and with it, the stone's power. It will be your posterity who will the stone in ages yet to come. <sighs> oh, great. We're carrying around a pretty rock. This stone is devoid of power. Yeah. Empty, yet full of thirst. What if we filled it up? A terrible longing to drink the world dry. Oh, that's not, that's less than ideal. Maybe. The power of men <gasps> and of magic. Oh, no. Someone's approaching. Of good and of evil. Okay, we haven't murdered it the guards. It is often those who desire Nethysite whom the Nethysite itself desires. To devour? Oh, dang. <sighs> <gasps> oh! Oh, you are the Larsa? tinier human. I should have known. Can't believe he's out here. Jeez. Where's your entourage? Where's your flying ship? Where's all- I guess he's running around on his own before- he's pretty self-sufficient. For a prince. Tsunami. 
to Baromises. I say we ought leave tomorrow. Oh, okay. I was going to wait for my escort to return, but meeting you here has presented a great opportunity. We're gonna work together. This terrible war can be stopped, but I will need your help to do so. Your people started it. A war. You know the Marquis Ondor leads a group of insurgents. Your pardon. He leads a large resistance force against the Empire. Lady Ash, neither of our countries can afford this now. The Rosarian Empire would stir. They would aid the resistance and use this aid as a pretext to declare war on Arcadia. And Arcadia would have no choice but to answer. Lady Ash, let us go to Bur Omases. With the blessing of his grace, the Grand Kiltius Anastasis, what? you may rightly wear your crown and declare the restoration of the Kingdom of Dalmasca. As queen, you can call for peace between the Empire and Dalmasca and stop Marquis Ondor. Uh, for peace? Yeah. How dare you say that? Yeah. The Empire attacked us, stole all we hold dear, and you would have me save them from war? Dalmasca would be the battlefield. What if Nethicide were used on Rabinasta? You know my brother would do this. <sighs> well, that's a rough decision. She's been holding Forgive on me. to vengeance I presumed over much. for a long time. I could think of no other way to avoid bloodshed. If you cannot trust me, then please take me as your hostage. We st he's still around? Rossler. Go back to the uh, oh, underworld or whatever. You saw him. Didn't you? Like at the king's tomb. So you did see him too. But why? It's strange. I don't know why Vaughn's seeing Before, him. I didn't even know what you looked like. And the prince? I barely knew there was a prince. Who knows? Maybe the person I saw was my brother. Bosch told me about him. He enlisted right at the end. But for what? He knew he couldn't win. To protect something. How can he protect anything when he's dead? Was it different from Prince Rassler? Did that make sense? I mean, he had to. Hating the Empire, getting revenge, it's all I ever thought about. But I never did anything about it. I mean, I realized there was nothing I could do. That's a very, uh... It made me feel hollow. Oh, what's the word? Um... Alone. Ugh. And then, I'd miss my brother. Easy to understand feeling. I'd say stuff like, I'm gonna be a sky pirate, or some other stupid thing. Just anything to keep my mind off it. I was just... I was running away. I needed to get away from his death. That's why I followed you. You know what? I'm through with it. I'm through running. I'm ready to find my purpose. To find some real answers. Some reasons. If I stick with you, I think I will. I wish I knew. I'll find him. Everybody's the main character in here except for Vaughn. He's like the sidekick. <laughs> Which is fine, it's an interesting... Like, I think he's, he's, he's the central character, but not necessarily the main character, you know? The protagonist. I think Bosch and Ash are more along the lines of... Or even Balthier, your friend. I will accompany you to Mount Baromises. I had hoped you'd say yes. I am glad. My heart is not set. I still have questions. I hope to find answers along the way. I had other reason to invite you. There is someone I'd like you to meet waiting on Baromises. Who is that? An enemy. And an ally also. You will just have to wait oh, and see for yourself. Oh! Is it Vossler? Did Vossler live? I'm, I'm guessing Vossler. That Larsa likes his secrets. 
He does not mean ill by it. How do you know? He, he does. He's not bad. At least for an Imperial. Are they gonna date? <laughs> Is she gonna fall for a younger man? Holy Mount Burrow Misace stands at the northern end of the Yagd Ramuda. Once we're in Yagd, we need not fear pursuit by their airships. Don't get your hopes up. You remember the Leviathan sailed straight over the Yagd Yensa, right up to Raithel's tomb. Skystone that works even in Yacht. You know, Nether Sight's behind it. Little wonder they're so keen on the stuff. And what is it you're after, Balthier? Adventure! You're a welcome hand and a great aid, but why? Worried I'm out to steal the Nether Sight, eh? Can't say I'm unaccustomed to people doubting my intentions. Nothing could be further from my mind. Shall I swear by your sword or some such? <laughs> Apologies, but I needed to know where you stand. It's fair, right? Her Majesty depends on you, and you seem to have an interest in the stone. I'm only here to see how the story unfolds. Any self-respecting leading man would do the same. Mm -hmm. Oh, sure, Larsa, that's right. We had him for a little bit at one point. See how boned we are when we get to a new area and it's way over our heads. We're gonna leave, yes. Take this as a, is it the stick? Oh, a reeker crossbow and a quiver of onion bolts. I've yet to use those. If you would ride a chocobo, I can't say that right apparently. I have spoken to the Moogle, she will not charge you your first use of the chocobo. Take care on the road ahead. It should it lead back to our land. You're welcome, guest spirits of the land, much over you. Thank you. And you as well. Live long and prosper. I will save. The game does a pretty good job with the auto saves, but just in case. This is an old game, so I don't really trust it. But it is the remake of the old game. Um, anyway, I don't know, that whole thing with Vaughn where he was like, you know, I was angry all the time, but especially when I found out I couldn't, there was nothing he could do at, by himself against an imperial power, and that's an extremely frustrating and I can't think of the word, but like, feeling that a lot of people have felt, especially lately, is, I don't know, I kind of, it rung very true for what, what we've been going through in the last year or two or more, you know, so... Um, anyway, I think I'll leave it off here. I'm not sure exactly how long this will be, but I hope it's all right. But we're making progress, and I didn't I didn't have to grind it for too terribly long, just like two hours. <laughs> so, anyway, thank you all for joining me. I appreciate it, and I hope to see you in the next one.